So we want to get out to a shocking story right now coming out of Basha High School in Chandler. Some parents and students we talked to say there's a Snapchat going around telling students not to report to anyone if they have COVID or if they're feeling sick. Kim Powell went to get some answers tonight. She's joining us live from outside the school. Kim. Yeah, that message on the Snapchat focuses on student athletes, and if there is a known COVID outbreak within the school, they could miss out on their sports or their senior night. But at least one mom tells me it's not just the kids who are spreading that mentality. I'm not surprised, but I'm disappointed. <laughs> Miranda Rumsey and her sister go to Arizona College Prep, which is within the Chandler Unified School District. They say they've been taking the precautions to stop the spread, but there's been talk from other students about not being transparent about COVID. That is sort of the idea that is being propagated that just if you're sick, just don't tell anyone. Don't tell anyone and let the chips fall where they may. A Snapchat going around social media starts off by saying, quote, I'm asking this on behalf of all athletes at Basha. Please, for the love of God, if you get COVID or have symptoms, don't report it. Yeah, that's not smart. That's definitely dangerous. Um, they'll just cause another outbreak and it just won't end well at all. Brandon Ewing graduated from Basha High School in 2019. He thinks the athletes should be patient. I feel like it's pretty risky right now to be playing sports out with COVID, and especially if you're doing it without anyone knowing. So. We are going to see teachers die. I mean, that is what is going to happen. Andrea Rumsey says she's heard other moms urging families to keep it private if they are exposed to COVID or if they test positive. People feel now like they can even say it out loud. Like, yeah, we, just, we probably have COVID, but we're not going to tell anyone. The Chandler Unified School District sent this letter to parents highlighting their response to COVID, but also telling families they cannot do this alone. It's just going to get worse and worse if we don't. If people don't start taking the steps that everyone's saying you have to, there's going to be no improvement. Now, the district spokesperson told me they encourage all families to keep students home if they've tested positive for COVID or if they are being tested. According to the district dashboard, there are currently eight active COVID cases at Basha High School. For now, reporting live in Chandler, I'm Kim Powell for Arizona's Family.